I was told to make the video, a symbolic video about uh, what police officers claimed me will be actually deciding about my life. Uh, police officers, excuse me, criminals, Slovenian criminals with police badges, investigators. This was an MK Ultra food all the time because when they poisoned, they poisoned so severely, uh, advanced the symptoms, whichever symptoms they wanted my body to suffer from. Uh, and over the course of the time, once this stuff was developed, don't think it was a bad food that was involved only. In initial stages, they would use whatever they used to poison. Uh, once the body was heavily poisoned, they would continue to poison even using this. So you have this kind of stuff and next to this kind of stuff that's used for the kidneys and so on to cure them. Uh, they would use poison, whatever whatever poisonous food they use along the way parallel to this so that the body would suffer like maximum uh, damage. I was surprised when I learned garlic. A lot of garlic also was used during MKUltra. Um, but I'm not surprised because they would do the stuff like this for the body under optimal conditions to have a difficult recovery uh, to a normal state. Uh, this, I was told, for this I was told that, hey, I was poisoned, I was poisoned, like you have no idea how they poisoned, uh, and brought to the homes of the police officers who would tell me that this is the stuff that I have to buy and eat, yeah? And they treated me inside of their homes with this shit. I mean, it's difficult from a psychological point of view to explain what kind of bullshit violent this was, you know? So you're being poisoned, poisoned, poisoned. I was poisoned. They poisoned me during MK Ultra for Since till 2020, thirty years, and you would be literally pointed out what you would be using to cure yourself. I don't know if you can cure this, because it became, in my opinion, it became an acute problem. They insisted me that MK Ultra that I'm gonna have to use this every here and there that this is what I'm gonna have to use. And they told me that your life eventually is gonna depend on purchase like this. Hey, you're gonna say I am insane. I was driven insane. I definitely was driven insane, but What you see here is like, they did the same thing to me with the honey. They told me you have to go buy honey and stuff like this. Then what they did is they spoiled the honey and stuff like this. Then the game by destroying the honey started and so on. Um, this stuff here, however, I learned yesterday when I took one home and I ate one, uh, did help. So I know that the kidneys, liver and kidneys, kidneys, through the kidneys, they progressed everywhere else in the body. Uh, through the poison, they, they progressed chronical problems. Uh, I knew the difference yesterday when I purchased two of this and I ate two of them. Uh, enormous difference in my body, the way I felt, the sound. 
it disappeared. That means that the sound rather is related to anemia. I don't know what's going on. Uh, kidneys, liver, whatever might be the issue, probably even kidneys. Uh, but I do believe that if anything is going to help me out, it's going to be this stuff. When they would poison me, they would deliver me to other countries, to Italy. Italy is more south of Slovenia, and they have cherries and stuff like this inside of the supermarkets. That's what police would do. They would buy themselves fresh cherries and stuff like this, and they would deliver me and come to pick me up to Italy and deliver me back to Slovenia. This here was very expensive, yes, but the only hope, the last dimes basically went for this stuff. This here was a big ass tree, cherry, this tree here, uh, they pulled everything out. Uh, there was a big ass tree that would go all the way up to the balcony and it would probably be the only tree that always never froze because of the house because it's close to the house tremendous giant cherry well uh, upon my return from poland in 2020 uh they got the tree they they chopped the tree down they threw the tree down mother did so that i would not get anywhere near cherries and so for that stuff i was told i'll make a difference between life and death when police officers criminals excuse me with police badges were confronted in italian supermarkets about their whereabouts buying for themselves cherries and stuff like this while keeping me poisoned uh, the only thing that happened was they discussed the problems inside of the house with Italian politicians and when I say discussed uh, talking about British royals here Prince Charles, Prince Andrew whom Vladimir Putin used so they always had the upper hand on everything and basically this is how it went this is just uh, just basically the way they did this those are the last dimes I spent that you have seen on those cherries this is the last, last dollars euros that went for that so did you know how this shit went uh, hey uh, when I'm gonna demonstrate you in what kind of uh, state my body was for the last eight months nine months when I was pissing blood on a daily basis, 24-7, you will understand what I am talking about.